Hello friends and welcome back to the World Cup. Today's game, Norway against Australia in the second round. And if we get through, and I expect to get through, a second game of the episode against Sweden or France, depending who qualifies, I expect France to go through. So let's not waste any more time. Marcus, Björken, Ostigard, Ayer, Peterson, Berg, Palumbo, Odegaard, Nusa, Schilderup and Haaland up front against Australia. Let's do it for the fans, boys. Let's do it for the fans. Nobody cares. Yes. Yes. Okay. People are getting motivated. That's what we like to see. Okay. First highlight. Nusa. Plays it back to Peterson. Berg. Palumbo. Berg. Björken in the penalty area. He has a yellow card. Shelter up is there. Plays it back to Björken. Oh, you had a chance to shoot, mate. And save hands from their goalkeeper. Ayer. I don't recognize uh, any of uh, the Australian players. New faces, probably. It's 2030. Yeah. Odegaard. Long ball towards Haaland. He's there. He gets to it. Haaland. 1 0. Yes. Just after nine minutes. Huge mistake by. Uh, their defender there, he was daydreaming or something. This guy, Pinto, yeah. Haaland, great job, mate. 1-0, his fourth goal of the World Cup. Here we go again. Oh, Peterson is going to get sent off, for fuck's sake. Mate, what the hell? Jesus Christ. Okay. We're going to sacrifice, I'm going to sacrifice Patrick Berg. Yeah. I don't want to take off uh, Palumbo. And get Dokken in. Come on, Dokken. Oh, Peterson, what the hell, mate? Yeah, now Australia. Have a free kick. Rustic, it's in. 1-1. One, one. Oh, we're gonna get knocked out by Australia. For fuck's sake. Jesus Christ. Kick off highlight. Palumbo. Yeah, we're not gonna score. Come on. Bjorkan. I'm not going defensive or anything because uh, they're gonna come uh, thick and fast <laughs> all over us. I'm gonna keep it the way it is. I don't care what happens. Palumbo. Uh, actually, I do care what happens, but you know what I mean. Bjorken. Keep it positive, boys. Come on. Imagine if Bjorken gets sent off now. Shelter up! Oh! Nice try, mate. Okay, another highlight. Here's Nusa. Nusa. Shelter up. In the penalty area. Back to Bjorken. Palumbo. He's involved in every highlight, uh, Bjorken, so far. Palumbo gets a cross in. Holland. Might. Might have been offside. Let's see it. I think he was offside. Yeah, it's disallowed. But we're creating chances, even though we're one man down. Here we go again. 48 minutes in. Odegaard, Palumbo. Bell it from the back, boys. That's it. I are all the way back to Marcus. Don't hoof it forward. But Palumbo gets to it. Shoulder up. Shoulder up. Haaland. Yes, boys. Come on. Yes, mate. His fifth goal of the World Cup. Oh, boy. Great job, shoulder up. 2-1. Okay. Let's keep it like this until halftime. I'm not going defensive. That's not going to happen. I'm happy. Yeah. I'm happy. Let's kick off the second half. Ostigard is on a yellow card and he's not playing too well. Nusa on a 6.4. Yeah, I'm taking off uh, Nusa. I don't care how good you are. You're playing bad. Evian is coming in. And you know what? Daland for Ostigard. I have faith in you boys. Come on. Palumbo. Bjorkan. This is a proper highlight. Shelter up. Bjorken, oh, okay, the subs uh, should uh, come in now. 
A corner for Australia now. Get it away. Ayer was there. Solid defender. Boyle, come on. A chance for a counter attack. Oh, that guy. That guy made a good run here. Yeah. Yeah. They've equalized. But I'm still happy with the way we played. I, I really am. I'm going to encourage them. We can do this, boys. Come on. Bjorkan is having a fine day. So is Palumbo. Shadurap is really tired. Have you know, 6.5. I should sub off. Yeah, we've been unlucky. I'm going to tell them that. And uh, no substitutions yet. I still have one more sub. I think this is going all the way to penalties. Shelter up is really tired. Yes, I'm uh, I'm subbing off shelter up. Yeah, yeah, be my for shelter up. I have faith in you. And let's see this highlight. Yeah, shelter up is dying on the pitch. Can't run anymore. Oh my word, what a mistake from Ayer. Come on, mate. What the hell? And oh my god, that was really lucky. That was really lucky. Yeah, we're going to penalties. Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, Haaland is going to take the first penalty. Sure. Oh, I'm going to put... Ayer, second one. Odegaard. Not Fiabema because he's anxious. Uh, Bjorkan. And uh, Martin Palumbo, the fifth one. Pep talk. Stay calm. Show the courage. Yeah, stay calm and back yourselves up. Yeah. Okay, let's do this. We've seen some penalty shutouts with Leverkusen this season. We've won them all. Haaland scores. Marcus, you were a hero against Belgium in the qualifiers. Do it again, mate. Rustic, the guy that scored from that wonderful free kick. He missed it. Great job, Marcus. Okay, we have advantage. Ayer, score, mate. Yes, sir. Goalkeeper went the other way. Gordon for Australia. Come on, Marcus. Another save from you, mate. Yes, Marcus. Oh, those Leverkusen goalkeepers. You gotta love them. He's gonna save another one. Just you see, Odegaard. He should score. He does. We're free nil up. Come on, Marcus. Do it again, mate. I know you can do it again. There were some poor takers for uh, Australia. Come on. Oh, so close, Marcus. So close, mate. Okay, Bjorkan. Come on, mate. Bjorkan is going to score. I know he is. Just look at it. It's in and it's done. We've made it to the third round on penalties. Oh, Peterson, you asshole. Nice work, everyone. All right, I'll see you guys for the first round. We're gonna... Yeah, we're going to play France. But before we get to that, let's see what happened in the other games in the second round. Spain got past Morocco 3-0, Uruguay, Colombia 2-0, Belgium, Jamaica 5-1, Italy got past Guinea 4-0, Ireland 3-1 against Chile, England beat Argentina 3-2, Wales after extra time 3-1 against uh, the Ivory Coast, Portugal, Brazil 1-0, Senegal knocked out Germany on penalties after 2-2, this is a big surprise, we got through, of course, you saw that. France uh, beat Sweden 3-0, Mexico, Algeria 3-2, Scotland, Tunisia 2-0, the Netherlands got past Nigeria 2-0, and the US against Croatia 3-2. So the third round looks something like this. Spain against Italy, a big one. Uruguay against Belgium, Ireland, Portugal, England against Wales, Senegal, Mexico, Norway, France, Scotland, Poland, and the Netherlands against the US. Now let's play France. I just, so my assistant manager suggested I rested some players, a lot of them. 
I mean, yeah, I uh, dropped Odegaard. He's uh, really tired. Sheldrop is going to be on the bench as well. Patrick Berg, so I'm bringing Burge. I'm keeping Palumbo, Ayer and Doken, even though they uh, are uh, tired. I don't really have a choice. Bjorken is tired as well, right? No, they say he's match fit. I brought in Fiabema on the left as an inside forward. I kept Palumbo, pri probably sub him off uh, in the second half. I just can't afford against France to drop Ayer or uh, Martin Palumbo. Yeah, so uh, let's see what happens. The pressure is all on them. Yes, let's go with this one. Yeah, but France played in the same day as we had. This match takes place just three days later after uh, the game against Australia. But we got all the way to penalties and uh, that got us uh, some tired legs. Here we go. Five minutes in. Doken. Aron, too bad I had to drop Odegaard, but I didn't have a choice. Maybe we'll see him late in the second half. Here's Haaland. He missed it. We do have a corner. Come on, mate. Nusa is going to take the corner. Get it to Ayer or someone. No. Do we get to see the throw-in? Nope. Ostigard, it's already on a yellow card. Jesus Christ, mate. Fiabema. He's probably going to be suspended if we get through, but I don't think it's going to happen. Fiabema in the penalty area. Oh, so close to an own goal there. Burge is also on a yellow card. A chance for France and that might be a penalty. Oh, for fuck's sake. When we started so well. Yeah, it's going to be a penalty. But for what? Was aggressive. Doken was aggressive. Okay. Yeah. Marcus cannot save that. Goes the other way. And France are one up. Let's uh, let's encourage them. I'm not going to demand more. Not yet. Malogusto with a throw in. Yeah, they uh, still have a great uh, squad. They have Moron Papon somewhere uh, on the left side, I think. Guiri. They're 2-0 up. Oh, for fuck's sake. Now I'm going to berate them. What the hell? We started so well. Look at possession. Oh my word, then we're 2-0 down. Come on, boys. Nusa with a corner. Just get one in, please. Aaron, Bjorken, Ostigard, Ayer, Doken. He's Aaron. Alan takes his shot. That's not how you score a goal, mate. Okay, we're 2-0 down. I'm not going to go with that. Show me something better. Show me something better for fuck's sake, Sanderberg. It's coming off and Patrick Burge is coming in. I'm keeping Martin Palumbo just for a little while. All right, let's start the second half. I'm going attacking and uh, I'm going to demand more. How is this happening with all that possession? Ayer gets subbed off. Throwing, Doken. Come on, what the hell, mate? Get it back. That's it, Berg. Holland. Come on. If we can score one now, there's plenty of time to equalize. Oh, my word. Yeah, it's just not going our way today. We had our chances. We missed them all. Nusa is coming off and Evian is coming in. Another highlight. This one for France to make it free. Berg recovers the ball. He's Doken. That's a good ball to Holland. Back to Avian. Great job, Holland. Avian. And will calm it down. Aaron. Avian again. Doken. That's a good ball. Okay, we got lucky there, but Fiabema gets into the penalty area. Just get it to Holland, please. And that's it, mate. Come on. Come on. There's still time. I'm demanding more. Come on, give me another highlight, please. Five minutes remaining, I'm pausing the game and uh, I don't know what to do here. More direct, higher tempo. And let's distribute our opposition defense. And uh, let's get you on attack. 
move you a little bit forward you get over here you over here you get uh, an inside forward an attack and i don't know let's hope we can get a highlight please no highlights it's done okay hey we did put up a good fight actually if you look at the stats we were better than France. Yeah. It's frustrating. It really is. You did yourself proud. Today. That's what I'm going to say. All right. Now, uh, don't go anywhere. I'm going to skip to the end uh, of the World Cup and uh, see what happened. And if I get uh, any news about a job opportunity, I'll come back with that. All right. I'm back. Let's take it from the third round all the way to the final. So Spain won against Italy 1-0. Uruguay got over Belgium on penalties after 0-0. Portugal, Ireland 2-1. England, Wales 2-0. Mexico got past Senegal 2-0. France got one over us 2-1. Scotland on penalties against Poland after 0-0. And the Netherlands, USA 3-1. Quarterfinals. England, Spain 2 0. Uruguay again on penalties after 2 2 with uh, Portugal. The Netherlands 2 1 against Mexico. And uh, Scotland knocked out France after extra time. Good for Scotland. Semi finals Scotland, England 1 0. So Scotland made it to the final. Okay. And the Netherlands 2 1 against Uruguay. Third place. Uruguay got third place 2 1 against England. And. Scotland are the new World Cup champions. 4-2 against the Netherlands after extra time. The Netherlands once again losing another final. All right, so Scotland won the World Cup. Jesus. The world we live in in 2030. Now, there's no new jobs opportunity. Well, actually, Hertha Berlin popped up. Uh, Leeds United are still available. Um, I'm not going to Leeds United, like I said. Uh, I'm still waiting. Uh, Matt Hamels, I think he was in Spain. Oh, he's unemployed. Okay. And this guy? Sheffield. So, uh, no, the merry-go-round is not going to happen yet. So, I'll probably have to wait um, until January. Maybe some uh, managers will get sacked. Then, I don't know. So uh, next episode, uh, I'm not going to come back with every time with uh, news about jobs opportunities or interviews or something. No, the next episode, I'll just come back straight uh, to our new job, our new club, maybe in Italy, maybe in England. We'll see. All right. Thank you guys very much for watching. Too bad we got knocked out. I think we got offended by France, but we go again. I'm not going to quit my jump from Norway. Yeah. I'm going to rebuild the squad and take it from there and uh, try to take it to the Euros. Now, thank you guys very much for watching. Subscribe, give a like, leave a comment, and I'll see you for the next one. Wait, 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 wait. Actually, I might resign from Norway because Haaland just ended his international career. Yeah, at the age of 29. I uh, tried to make him uh, reconsider, but uh, yeah, it's not going to happen. I don't know if I want to stay now. Why? Why would you do that, mate? You're only 29. Jesus, I can't believe this. Yeah, anyway, uh, I'll see you for the next one. I don't know. I might resign. I don't know.